Fernandez and I'm an art teacher. Visit my website at cattyfernandezartist.com. Okay, let's draw. Today's project is how to draw different landforms. So the first thing I'm going to do is I'm going to label my paper land forms. And then underneath that I'm going to put three fingers on the left and put a dot. And from that dot I'm going to draw straight diagonal up, straight diagonal down, come up midpoint, straight diagonal up, down, straight diagonal up, down, off the page. I come back to the first one and I'm going to draw a wavy, wavy, wavy line. Connect. Come up to the second one, draw a wavy, wavy line. Connect. Come up to the third one, draw a wavy, wavy line. Connect. And this landform, these are mountains. M O U N T A I N S. Now I'm going to come right underneath my mountains and I'm going to draw a slightly wavy line from left to right all the way across. I come back to the left and I'm going to start right here and draw a curve line, straight line, curve line up, straight line down, connect, come on the left side, curve line up, down, connect. Right next to that one I'm going to draw a straight line up, curve line, Curve line, curve line down, straight line. And if you have room, one more little curve line, straight line. Straight line up, curve line, curve line, straight line down. I'm going to put little dots inside. And I'm going to put some straight lines. Just one, two doesn't matter where they go, just put a couple all the way around. And right next to that I'm going to draw a baby circle and I'm going to draw a curved line and then I'm going to draw two curved lines going up. And this is the desert. D-E-S-E-R-T. Okay. Now I come down again and I'm going to draw curved lines going all the way across. And I'm going to come back inside on the left. And I'm going to draw a curved line, curved line, curved line. Keep going. Curved line, curved line. And on top of my curved lines, I'm going to draw a straight line and then a curve up, down. Straight line, curve line up, down, jump over, straight line, curve line up, down, maybe one here, here, straight line, curve line up, down, all the way across, straight line, curve line, curve line, all the way across, keep going, straight line, curve line, and these this landform, these are hills. Hills, H I L L S. Now I come down again and I'm just going to draw a barely wavy, slightly wavy line from left to right. And then I'm going to draw it again. Barely, barely, left to right. And every once in a while I'm going to put one, two, three. One, two, three, four, straight lines. One, two, three, four. And a, right about here, I'm going to put a little curve line. Little curve line. This is basically very flat, and that's because it is a plane. P L A I N. Okay. Now I come underneath that and I draw a curve line up, down, up, down, up down, up, off the page. And what I'm going to focus in on is a straight line and a triangle. Straight line and a triangle. 
straight line in a triangle because what I'm pointing to is a valley. V-A-L-E-Y V-A-L-L-E-Y V-A-L-L-E-Y. This will all make more sense once we start coloring. Then right below this I'm going to do a line of spirals going across and that's basically a curved line hook it onto the curved line curved line curved line and then at the very bottom a very very skinny mini slightly wavy line because this is the coast by the ocean by the beach so we start up top with mountains, go to the desert, hills, a plain, a valley, and a coast. All right, let's see how we're going to color these in. Okay, I went through my crayon box, and I'm going to do the bottom part of my mountains brown. And then I'm going to do my caps purple. Or you could keep them white if you wanted it to be snow. Then I work my way down and I do my cactus, a yellow green. I do my sun in the desert, a yellow yellow. And I go around that whole environment with my blue green. I come down to my hills. And I'm going to do my sky background color blue, regular dark blue, all the way across. You can make your flowers any color you want. I did pink. So these little halves, half curved lines, these are all flowers. And then I'm going to make my hills a really nice green. So the hills are all green. Then I come down to my plane, and it's very flat and very dry. So I'm going to do my plane, mostly apricot in the background or a light brown. I'm going to come in and do just a little bit of this with a darker brown. And I'm going to add just a little bit of green for some vegetation, some shrubs. Not too much, okay? Now, for my valley, I'm going to go back and use my brown for this part. But for the actual valley, valley part, I'm going to do that dark green. So I'm going to take my green and color this section inside green. Because that's the way a valley can be. It can be a section down below a bigger landform. And then, so I don't get mixed up, I'm going to make my little arrowheads red or red-orange. I come down to my coast and I'm going to make the main part of my spirals blue-green, turquoise blue, and the bottom part light brown or beige. Okay, so those are your main landforms. Now, just to fill in the white up at the top, I'm going to just take a blue, and I'm just going to draw some straight lines background for that. Okay? Let's see what it looks like all colored in. Here are my landforms all colored in, ready to go with my bodies of water. Okay, bye-bye.